Welcome back, Seahawks. It's Carly. And Sergio. It's Ryan. And Casey. And, and these, these are your Seahawk updates. Let's go. Seniors, the last thing to purchase your ticket for $110 is the 18th of this month. This night is going to be fun, so don't miss out. We'll be going to Disneyland California Adventure, bowling, and breakfast. Don't miss out, seniors. It's going to be a good time. Hi, this is Team Coffee Club, and we'll be meeting next week on January 15th in Mr. Bolo's room, which is uh, room 315. This week's uh, theme is friends, so we'll be serving Madeline's, uh, variety of macarons, black tea blends. And if you're not already a member, it's $3, but if you are, come get your tea and snacks. Thank you. Dropout. Dress up or dress down. Hey Seahawks, Tuesday is Crazy Sock Day. Wednesdays, we go together Wednesday. It's twin day, so find yourself a twin. Hey Seahawks, Thursday is Summer Lovin'. So make sure to wear your summer wear or your bright clothing. You're the one that I want Friday. Lower classmen wear red. Upper classmen wear black. Don't forget. America is having a meeting today at lunch in Ms. Juby's room, room 621. Come by to hear about some really fun opportunities like Winter Congress and a service project with Whitney High School. What's going on ladies and gentlemen, it is The Wheel Report. I am your host Max Nelson and I am here with Helen Reynolds. Uh, Helen and the girls Seahawks just led our basketball team to a big win in our first league game over Western Helen. Uh, Western was starting to rally late, you know, how did you guys come back and just kind of win the game? Um, it was kind of tough because we dropped a big lead that we had um, to like two or three points, but we realized that we just wanted it more. We were playing harder, we're more fundamental, and that we just needed to catch that dub. So you had a double double and you had 31 points that matches your career high. Yeah. How does it feel to match that and also get the win? It's kind of frustrating that I keep getting 31 and not beating 31, but I'm not mad about it. Okay, and then uh, we saw some. Uh, coaches from colleges tonight, you know, you can you talk about that? Or? Um, OCC and Cypress were here tonight, um, and then I got some other coaches talking to me. So yeah, we'll see what happens. Sweet. So also, tonight, uh, as of this recording too, uh, they are taking on Garden Grove, so you guys should come out, come see how the Come watch us fall out. Maybe she'll break 31 tonight, we'll see. Let's hope. Fingers see, crossed. Why you should see come you guys out. there. See you tonight. What's going on, Wheel Report? Uh, one last VA for you guys. Uh, I'm here with Vincent Kaiser of uh, Boys Basketball. Uh, they just destroyed Western's boy ba boys basketball team. Uh, so, Vincent, you guys kind of came out um, really strong. You kind of wanted to get this first game. Uh, what does it mean for you guys to win your first league game? It feels great, man. Come out here. we got a long road ahead of us, 10 games. And to get this first one, get that momentum, it feels really good. We've been working really hard at practice leading up to this. We just came off of a tournament that we did pretty well in. You know, just trying to bring energy every day to get to this point and just bring it forward all the way through the week. Okay, and they are playing tonight at Garden Grove, so make sure to come out, right? Yeah, come out and watch us. We're going to get the second dub of the week. Yeah, 2-0. That's what we're looking for tonight. Let's go. What's going on? It is the Wheel Report. It is your host, Max Nelson, here with a few updates. Uh, wrestling. This Wednesday, uh, it's their senior night. Make sure to come out at 4 o'clock. Uh, varsity will start around 4.30, 4.45 uh, is their senior night. And make sure to come out for people like Jason Nguyen and Jonathan Martinez, two of our seniors. So, see you there. Before the break, boys soccer came up a little short in their spotlight game. But they are working really hard in their training, and they're trying to get ready for that senior night game coming up soon. So, look out for that. Girls Soccer took a big dub 2 to nothing in their spotlight game. Shout out to Alex and Leah for both of the goals. Make sure to look out for some more updates about them in the future. So, OV Unified practices volleyball every Monday during zero period. So if you don't have a zero, you know, come out, practice, play some volleyball with some of us. And then uh, on Friday, today, at lunch, you know, come and support. It's going to be lit. Uh, we uh, do some stuff other than volleyball, too. And volleyball, our tournament's coming up in about a month, so come and practice if you've never played before. 
come out. It's a fun time, and uh, you get to hang out with this guy. So, I mean, why wouldn't you come out? Hey, Seahawks, and this Tuesday, there's a girls water polo game at 3, January 15th. Be sure to go out there and support your fellow Seahawks. But Seahawks, you have these special talents that you're hiding. Make sure to come out February 8th and the 9th to try out from 5 to 6. Make sure to pick up the application in Melton's room. See you guys there. Hey Seahawks, we just wanted to give you guys a little Clash of Classes update. So currently, the seniors are in the lead. Be sure to participate in the Spirit Week and Rally activities next week. Hey Seahawks, happy Friday. Hey, welcome back. I hope your first week back wasn't too painful for you guys because we only have about five more days after today until finals. So make sure you guys study hard, get all that stuff done, but please get some sleep while you're studying for your finals. Make sure you eat a nutritious meal and finish strong. And then you get a whole new start once we come back for second semester. Also, guys, I think you heard our announcements this week. Get involved. We have Sadie's right around the corner. It's a really fun dance. It's not too expensive, so I hope you guys can attend, and I hope to see you there. Have an awesome weekend. Love you guys. Thanks for watching Seahawks. We'll see you next week. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, Seahawks, can't, can't spell love without OB.